performance by the team? Uh, yeah, I mean, dig ourselves a hole. You know, it takes us a while to wake up, and that's unfortunate because it's very hard to come back when you do that, you know, and we got to just find a way to, to start the games better. You know, I think it's been a theme maybe in, in a few games over the past, over the time I've been here, to be honest. And um, yeah, it, it takes us too long to get into the game. I mean, when we then we're down 2-0 and, you know, we start playing better, we start pressing more, we start being more intense, winning maybe balls higher up the field. And, you know, it's hard <laughs> at that time. Danny said he felt like the, the team really kind of had that air let out of it by the first goal. Uh, what was your thought, thoughts and, and sense after that opening goal? Yeah, it was a bit of a, a bit of a blow, and then I, I felt like as long as we we don't concede the second one, I felt like we would be would be okay. Um, but I think leading up to the second one, there was I had a couple corners, a couple you know better spells, and and you could sense it almost coming. Um, and uh, yeah, it's a, you know another set piece that we give up, same as the third, and you know those are moments that are, are coming down to will and and, and want, and, and you know I'm going to be the guy that wins the ball and, and not let the other defender get a free run and a free header, um, you know, and I think we we all have to have to look at that and, and be better in those moments, um, yeah. But again, if if, if it stays one zero, I felt like we would have been okay, and and you know knowing that maybe in the second half we get a good wave and. Um, guys coming off the bench, all that stuff. So, um, yeah, the second one, I, I think the second one was probably more more so than the first. But um, again, it was you know after the first goes in, it, it's a it was a there was a spell for them as well. So so it was a I guess I can see why why he senses that. Uh, I mean, the Lucas Cavallini's red card obviously gets kind of the, the headlines, but there were a lot of yellow cards out there, a lot of questionable tackles. What were your thoughts on just the overall? physicality of, of this game I mean these games you know they're they're intense you know and that's that's how they should be they're basically playoff games like today was a huge huge game huge matchup and if you look at the standings it's really tight you know and and that's how that's how those games are in this league at this at this stage of the year you know and then that's it's okay it's it's the referee's job to manage it I haven't seen Lucas's red card to be honest and you know all the little things um, you know some result in yellow cards some don't and and that's um, that's okay. That's that's part of this this stage of the season. I think. Ben, he was quite adamant in that <clears throat> he felt the team. It was a loss of self-respect. That he should apologize to the fans for the way the team performed tonight. As a player, how do you react to something when your coach says something like that? Well, I think we have to self-reflect. You know, I don't. I'm, I'm not saying total opposite here. No, I'm kind of thinking the same thing. Obviously, you know, if we. If we lose 3-0 at home in a in a really really big game, that's that's nowhere near good enough, you know. And, and I think we have that standard in the locker room um, to to you know be in those games and not not have it, have the outcome be that way. So um, yeah, I mean it's it's again it's a game that we have to think about a lot and we have to go into you know learn a lot from you know because we can't keep digging ourselves holes and and, and trying to crawl out of them in the last. 45, 50, 60 minutes, you know, that's that's very difficult to do, um, especially the later it gets in the season, you know, and um, we have six games left. I mean, there's nothing to lose now for us, you know, we have to more so play for our pride, play for, you know, our fans, because again, I think they des they do deserve better, especially at home here. You talked about taking away lessons from a game like this. Uh, I know it's still early, it's still fresh. Is there anything that comes to your mind when you say that? Well, I think I've, I've said it. I think it's the start of the game, right? Like, and, and, and the set pieces that, you know, where on the first goal, I think we're, we can take the foul. I know it's early in the game. We know that he scores from, from 25 yards out. You know, I, would, I wouldn't have thought that either. But at the same time, you know, why not just take the foul and take the yellow? Okay, you know, we move on. Um, and, the, and then again, on the set pieces, we all got to be better. You know, it, it's, it can't be. It's such an easy way to give up goals on set pieces, you know, and, and give away games like we did today, you know, and, and that's um, obviously the theme um, today. And, and then for us to wake up too late is, is yeah, just not good enough from all of us and, you know, including myself, obviously. And we got to we got to try and find ways to be better from from minute one and, and not uh, and stay in games, because, again, I feel like whenever we're in the games we're um, you know, you see that in Salt Lake, we have we have a, a spirit 
late in games that that we can get results and we can get wins. Um, so, yeah, it's it's about the start and, and how we how we uh, yeah defend crucial critical moments uh, in the first half.